but I'm just gonna see a few of them. So they gave us different schedules just to ma uh, maintain the number of people in one classroom, you know, the social distancing and stuff. So, so today's my day and it's a Friday. So dark, it's still very early, I'll show you. The sun is still rising, Ooh. doing that. And also today, I'm gonna show you what we do in the kitchen at school what our school looks like. It's practically um, an exam today. An exam where we cook and the, the teacher will grade by how it will taste, how it will look. And I'm like that.
special ways to throw. Drink what, it. What the hell are you talking about? No? It's white wine. <laughs> It's already... What time is it? It's already... 11.58 p.m. And... The husband is sleeping. This is not what you think it is. Okay, I'm gonna show you what this is. This is for the finger. So when you cut yourself, you will not contaminate the food that you're cooking. But this is what it's for. For example, I cut my little pinky. So I just... And then wrap it with a bandage or something. Just to keep your wood safe. To keep you and the people that will eat your food safe. Yeah? Okay. Now for the most important bag that we all need to bring at school every time we have some practicals is... This is like a whole set of kitchen stuff, including this bag. This comes with the uniform and the kitchen shoes that we got from academia. So it's part of the attrition fee that we pay for. So we already get our own kitchen stuff so we don't need to buy. You already have your own stuff with you, which is convenient and which is nice. I like it. With this one, um, a friend gave it to me, so I'm just using this tiny knife bag that I bring to school because I don't want to bring this, it's too big, it's too heavy, and I don't really need all of this stuff for tomorrow, so I just bring with me all the essentials. Mm. This is my weighing scale, so I bought this at the gift shop for like $10. So I bring my own, the school doesn't give this, so I bring it because we use one single scale for like all of us. So I just bring my own so it doesn't, you know, I don't need to borrow from someone else, which is annoying. So this is where I put my workflow planning. Like this one. Recipe card. This is from last Friday's um, first practical assessment, like a catch-up class. I think. Yeah. It's important that we bring a knife bag. We're not allowed to just stick our knives in the bag without any protective case or protective suit or bag for our knives. It's illegal to bring knives around without 
anything that's like this or protects the knife so us um, culinary or cookery students we at the beginning of the class this is one of the most important rules that we have to know policies that we have to know in in Australia or else you can go to jail you choose for tomorrow. I wish I could sleep like that. Oh my god, I look like in a horror movie. smart partner I can finish this very smooth the patisserie class made this one they're working on the other kitchen this puff pastry yeah. the rice Hi. he's from Jakarta is it Jakarta? Jakarta yeah Jakarta Indonesia this is Kenneth also from Indonesia Jakarta also yeah also in Jakarta Jakarta Taki is from Thailand What's that? What's that? You want to finish for this two question? Yeah. Why? You have to work, man. No, I, I just want to finish. So what? After finish, what you want to do? You still have to wait for everyone. Yeah. Her face is always like piece of. <laughs> I like this morning. Actually, it's really really a piece of. No, not Are you? 
No. Her normal face. My normal face. How old are you then? No, 25. <laughs> I got married at 23. Hi, Zach. Hello. Hi. We just finished our second catch up practical class. Yeah, second. And last catch up class. That's the last one, so I like, we're so good. <laughs> We're finally done! Yeah! <laughs> finally done with term 3. Uh, stage 3. Stage 3. So, so we just skip, you know. Yeah, we're officially at stage 4. However, we're still stuck because we can't do our... Placement. The placement. Yeah, we can't do a placement now because of Corona. So, Corona. we're here at Flagstaff. <laughs> Flagstaff uh, Park. Just after school, but it's around 3 p.m. Now at the station, going back to Werribee. So that's pretty much what we do at school, even before the coronavirus happened. But there used to be more students in one kitchen than what you have seen in my vlog. I would also like to thank my chefs that allowed me to vlog while doing the practical, Chef Matt and Chef Joshi. And of course to my classmates who have been so supportive with my new vlogging career. This has got to be my longest vlog ever, so thank you for sticking with me up till this very minute. And I'll see you again next time. Thank you for subscribing and watching. Love you lots.